what's going on guys so in today's video i'm going to be walking you guys through how you can be able to add a new bank account to your payoneer account okay so for some of you who don't know what payoneer is payoneer is actually an online payment platform that you can use to receive payment from the international marketplace okay you can use it if you're a freelancer you can use it if you're an athlete marketer you can use it if you are somebody that sells products online on marketplaces like amazon okay so that's what you have to use pioneer for and if you're new to this channel welcome my name is martin eo and on this channel i'll create video centers and learn making money online and if you want to be able to stay updated and get information that i share on this channel make sure to subscribe to this channel so that you can see strategies that you can use to make real money online okay so let me take you to the video and show you how you can be able to add your new account to your pioneer account okay so guys what you're seeing right here is my account okay so um what i will have to do right now once you log into your account it's going to bring you to this page so what you have to do is to go to settings okay so once you go to settings, you will see pioneer cards you will see bank accounts but before adding bank account make sure that there is no verification that you are supposed to verify with pioneer that you have not done because if you are if you do not verify what they needed you to verify maybe when you are creating your account they are not going to allow you to be able to add your account okay so guys make sure that all the informations that pioneer requires you to add that you have already added them okay so what you have to do now is that once you have verified everything just click on bank accounts okay so this thing will just load and bring us up here then just click on bank accounts for withdrawal because you want to add your bank account and be able to withdraw it to your local bank Abby. so as you can see right here i already have two bank accounts added on this account okay and pioneer also allowed me to add one more account okay so what i have to do here is just to click on add bank account so it's going to ask me with the bank account type whether it's personal or business i'm going to use personal then the bank country is nigeria then i'm going to select the bank uh, currency and make sure to when selecting the bank currency let me explain to you, so you understand what you're doing here the bank currency that you are going to select is going to depend on the account type that you open for example if you open a domiciliary account which is also known as a dollar account in nigeria here what you have to select here is a usd account because that's a domiciliary account the money that goes in there is usd don't go and select naira account so that you will not go go ahead and start having issues with them or lose your money entirely okay but if you are going to be putting your naira account which is your normal bank account that you used to receive naira and withdraw naira so you have to select naira okay so in this account what i'm going to select here is going to be naira because it's naira that i want to add i already have a usd that i added that i showed you guys earlier okay so i'll just select that i want to add my naira and i click on next okay so it will now bring up a place where i now have to enter the account details so i just have to select the bank here so the bank i want to use is zenith international bank plc okay so it asks me to put the person's name i'll put my name then account number just go ahead and you know put your account number here okay so once you put your account number just click i confirm the bank account details ab above are uh, correct okay so that's what you have to do so once you are done just click on next and um, pioneer is actually coming going to ask you to put your date of birth and make sure that you remember what you use as your date of birth because if you do not remember what you use here pioneer will definitely end up blocking your account okay so make sure you remember so first of all go ahead here and put your your birth date okay so i'll go ahead here and put mine all right Okay, so once you do that, then they will also ask you to put your pioneer password. Then just type in your pioneer. All these things are for security purposes because it's your account with them. 
So as you can see, bank account added. Account approval usually takes up to 30 minutes. We will email you when you can start withdrawing to this account. So as you can see, also see in some cases it's going to take three business days. But I will tell you, it's not going to pass this 30 minutes. Okay, as long as they are working right now. Okay. So you can go back to bank accounts and to see the bank accounts that you already have. As you can see, this is the latest one that I just added right now and it's showing me pending review. They have not been able to accept it right now. Okay. So as you can see, I have this one. This is a USD account, a DOM account and it's approved. And I have the first bank account and it's also approved. So I believe that this video is going to help you guys. And remember, if you are interested in a, a way that you are going to be able to make legit money online, make sure to subscribe to this channel and make sure to turn on that bell notification so that as I go along to drop this valuable video, you are going to be among the first people that is going to get access to the information I'm sharing here so that you can be able to make real money just like what you are seeing on my account right now for yourself okay thank you guys for watching this video and see you guys in my next video